everybody watching this video today I'm going to be showing you my custom moon cow or moon calf thingy I forgot what it's called from first man in the moon so yeah this is what image I used for like inspiration and this is the Lego model that I made it has the red eyes the weird horn on its head the little insect like legs, the crystals. Behind it looks really ugly, but people aren't really meant to see behind. Hey, looks quite cool. It's got some detail along the bottom. I could probably make a better version of this, like in a month or like a month and a half or even half a month to make a better version. I only made this in like half an hour, 40 minutes or so. But yeah, I think it's pretty good on how it turned out in that time. Here's an image of it again and where is it now? As you can see it's not too accurate to the film but if you're a person who's seen the first man in the moon and if I showed this, I'm pretty sure you would notice it. And know what it is. I really have a lot to talk about in this video. Well, I, all I basically have to do is tell you to like and subscribe. And leave a comment down below. On what you would like me to like build or review next. I have lots of Lego pieces to make builds with as you can see you can also do more lego set reviews but i don't really want to i want to focus on more like videos like the top 10 best movies or top 5 best stop motion monsters those types of things and custom world reviews or stop motions maybe create some stop motion series i don't know that's what you might be expecting next so yeah i'll probably be recreating this in like a month or a half or something and more or less like i already said but yeah that's all i have to say for today's video i just want to show you a bit of view of it which is this pretty good with all the crystals can be reassembled really quickly but yeah I don't really have a lot to talk about Also, if you are like uh, the average kid watching this video and you have not seen First Men in the Moon, I recommend it. Yeah, so it's from like 1964, I think. But it's really good. And I recommend it. So, anyways, goodbye.